types of crime. That concludes oral questions. Uh, I call on government order of the day number one. Ngāti Tūwhare Toa claim settlement bill, second reading. The Honourable Andrew Little. Mr Speaker, I move that the Ngāti Tūwhare Toa claim settlement bill be now read a second time. Uh, Mr Speaker, before I begin, I'd like to extend a warm welcome to those members of Ngāti Tūwhare Toa who have travelled here today to attend the second reading of their settlement bill, especially Sir Tumote Hiuhiu and the Tūwhare Toa Hapu Forum negotiation team. Ko aku mihi mahana kia koutou katoa. Mr Speaker, this bill gives, or Madam Speaker, this bill gives effect to the deed of settlement signed by Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa and the Crown at Waite Tokomarae last year at, on the 8th of July. This deed will be the final settlement of the historical Treaty of Waitangi claims of Ngāte Tōwhare Tōa that arose from the Crown's acts and omissions before the 21st of September 1992. The bill defines and settles the historical claims and comprises five parts detailing the cultural and commercial redress and significant Crown apology redress. This redress has been carefully negotiated with Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa and represents a restorative strategy for progress that is both enterprising and meaningful. Madam Speaker, the aim of the Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa Treaty Settlement is to, restore, uh, to resolve the historical grievances of this iwi and restore Ngāti Tōwhara Tōa's trust in the Crown by rebuilding our partnership based on the principles of the Treaty of Waitangi. I'd like to keep my remarks regarding this second reading short, and I look forward to describing the bill in, in more and further detail and sharing my reflections about its intended impact at the third reading. Madam Speaker, I'd like to acknowledge the work of the Māori Affairs Committee who have progressed this bill in a timely and professional manner. The committee began their consideration of this bill in December last year and considered 80 submissions in total from interested individuals and groups. In March this year, the committee travelled to Taupo to hear 29 oral submissions. Consequently, the committee recommended several minor and technical amendments to improve the bill, including the addition of 24 why claims that relate to Ngāti Tōwhara Tōa. I'm satisfied with these recommendations as they ensure that Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa Claim Settlement Bill has been robustly considered by the committee. I note a further amendment will need to be considered by way of a supplementary order paper during the Committee of the Whole House stage. This amendment relates to the Waipahihi Stream Conservation Area scheduled to return to Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa as a recreation reserve on settlement date. Madam Speaker, the second reading of this bill brings Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa and the Crown closer still to the conclusion of their settlement negotiation and their first steps together in a renewed relationship as partners. I commend the Ngāti Tōwhare Tōa Claim Settlement Bill to the House. Nō re rā, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā tātou katoa. The question is that the motion be agreed to. Before I call the next speaker, can I just um, confirm that our time clocks are still uh, not functioning, uh, and remind you, I'll give you a bell at two minutes remaining. I call Nuk Korakau. Nei rā mea, nei rā mihi uh, hohonu 